So I was hanging out with a bunch of friends last night. And, you know, we were having some fun playing games and whatnot. But there was a point of the night where my buddy decided to cut the music. And <laughs> he wanted to talk about some real things. And he decided to share his story. And, you know, it was very, it was very sentimental. It was very uh, eye-opening. And it really made me realize one thing. You know, as we were all sitting there listening to him and, and kind of bouncing off one another and feeding off each other's energy, it made me realize, like, yo, everybody's in a... Everybody's in a stage in their life where they feel stagnant, where they feel like they need to uh, live up to some sort of expectation that either they have set for themselves or that their parents have set for them or that or that they just subconsciously need to reach this standard because society says so. And everybody feels like they're not really going anywhere. Everybody has this feeling of uh, this this peer pressure, this internal pressure, um, and it's very much real, and it's very much, it's very much affecting people my age, um, I just graduated high school about, I want to say two years ago now, and I'll be damned, I would be lying if I said I know what I want, I, I have an idea of what I want, but I'm not sure how that idea can come into fruition. I'm kind of just um, expressing myself, being a free spirit, doing what I want to do, and seeing where that takes me. That's my MO. That's how I'm choosing to play this game. But I've realized other people around me don't know how they want to play the game. Other people don't know how to even play the game, to even like make it through the first level. So it's very eye-opening to me and, and, and it made me realize like nobody's perfect, number one. It made me realize that my problems are so minute and small and scarce and they don't compare to some of the problems that I've heard from other people. And um, it also made me realize that I'm not alone. There's people, I'm sure there's people out there that are watching this video that, that feel the same exact way, that feel like they're stagnant, they're not really going anywhere. And I, I want to just speak my mind and kind of help you get through that. I know words can only do so much, but I feel like if, if somebody is able to, to receive this message, if somebody out there is able to receive this message in a positive way, they're able to use it and and use it for for their own good um you know i'm gonna i'm gonna try to capture that opportunity right now um and it made me real like another thing because we were talking about how you know we all kind of express the same feeling of like feeling stagnant and feeling like we're not really going anywhere and there was something this girl said that really stuck out to me she's she was talking about opportunities she was basically saying i'm paraphrasing but she was saying like you know right now you may feel like you don't know what you want to do and this that and the third but you kind of just have to let life take you away and, and live in the moment and be present and try to capture every opportunity that you can and i agree with that like a lot of us are this is a quote that I've heard. I think it was in a book. I forgot what book it was. I forget what it's called, but the quote goes like this. It goes, let me put these shades on because I look like a... <laughs> I look like a freak. Anyway. The quote goes like this. The solution to a problem is merely the creation of the next one. And that's, that's exactly how it sounds. You know, a lot of us are so fixated on trying to be better, trying to put ourselves in a better situation, 
trying to be better than we were yesterday. A lot of us are so fixated on, on trying to become something better. But what that does, it, it only separates you from accepting who you truly are. And as a result, you will never be fulfilled. And that's why there's so much depressed kids. That's why there's so much uh, just kids that feel like they, they, they're worthless. They're not worthy enough. You know, and it doesn't help that we have social media. You guys already know how I feel about that. I don't even know. I don't even have to go off on on social media. It doesn't help that we have, you know, people showing off their lives, showing off the highlights of their life. You know, people showing off only one side of them to make other people feel less than, to make other people feel inferior. You know, there's so much comparison and and. and People always want to put themselves in a category or put, put themselves in a group of people or people want to try to identify with a certain, you know what I mean? Like everybody wants to try to find a place for them to fit in. But I'm here to let you know, bro, you're not you're not meant to fit in. You were born to stand out. You weren't brought here to to be somebody's sidekick or be somebody's bitch or be somebody's Robin. You were brought here to be your own person. There's only one of you. Don't waste that. Um, and, I, and I understand, like, there's nothing wrong with wanting better for yourself. There's nothing wrong, there's nothing wrong with, you know, wanting to put yourself in a better situation, wanting to grow, wanting to learn, wanting to be better than you were yesterday. There's nothing wrong with that. But I don't want you to get carried away with that thought. I don't want you to get carried away with that philosophy. I don't want you to get... Honestly, I don't want I don't want you to face a rude awakening because a lot of us, we have dreams, we have goals, we have aspirations. We want to make it somewhere. We want to, you know, make our families proud, make ourselves proud. But you need to understand that no matter how much you have, how many cars you drive, how big your house is, how much money is in your bank account. You're never going to be fulfilled, bro. You know why? Because happiness is only in the moment. Happiness is right here in front of you. Happiness is only found within. In the moment. When you're present. You can't find happiness in numbers because your search for happiness will never end. You can't find happiness in another woman because that woman needs to make herself happy first before she can make you happy. You can't find happiness in drugs because drugs wear off. You cannot find happiness in anything external. It needs to come from within. You need to be in alignment with yourself. You need to be in alignment with your goals. With what you want out of life. And I know it's hard. I know it's hard, bro. Life is hard, but if it was easy, everybody could do it. You got to be the one in your family you got to be the one that that creates another generation that creates another another family that 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 you want that lives by your rules that sees what you see um yeah man i i i've been through it we've all been through it we all feel like we need to Look at me right now, bro. I'm wearing a vest, a red shirt. I'm going to a job, a nine to five job. I'm about to clock in for at least like I'm clocking in for five hours and then I'm going to my apprenticeship after like, you think I want to do that, bro? Yeah, like I have to, I want to get up. I want to make money, but I don't always want to do this, you know? And I feel that that's just, that's just human, bro. That's just that's just human. You know, we all feel that. You're not alone. There's so much people out there that that have it worse. You know, you got to be grateful. You got to be appreciate what you have now. Appreciate the fact that you have a functional body. Appreciate the fact that you can move your arms and legs that you can conjure up your own thoughts that you have a thought process that you have an inner 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 monologue. 
appreciate the fact that you're able to to have other people feel your energy to have other people be receptive to it be grateful for the fact that you have a phone to even watch this video bro some some people don't even have electronics you know so you always got to be grateful you always got to appreciate what you have now because these are the times where you know you may feel like you're in a rut you may feel like you're you're stagnant you're not going anywhere but I'm telling you these are the times that you're you're going to you're going to miss the most you're going to appreciate these times you're going to appreciate the times where you're in the mud you're going to appreciate the times where you only had 100 subscribers when when you couldn't do a, a nolly or you couldn't do a kickflip you're going to appreciate the times where you couldn't beat that boss level you couldn't you know what I mean you're going to appreciate these times because these are the times that really shape who you are these are the times that are really going to build your character these are the times that are going to really test you and, and make you uncomfortable but it's all for a reason it's all to help you grow it's all to help you mature you know, if we were never to face adversity, we would never grow. If we were to never face roadblocks, we wouldn't know how to overcome the roadblocks that are that are further ahead. You know what I mean? So everything happens for a reason. Every, everything is happening for you, not to you. Remember that. It's not happening to you. It's happening for you. For, for the betterment of yourself. For the maturity of you for the growth of you so that's all i pretty much got to say yeah if you guys left this video motivated inspired or a better person then i did my part other than that peace love positivity i love you guys make the best out of your life i say this all the time none of us were asked to be born but we're here so you owe it to yourself you owe it to the people you love to make the best out of your life every single day and live life to the fullest bro because as far as i'm concerned i don't know if there's anything i don't know if there's anything after this i, I don't know honestly nobody knows so if this is it if this is the only life we get to live then live it to the fullest bro do what you want to do be a free spirit stop stop um stop meeting people other people's needs stop trying to please other people stop trying to please your parents so much please yourself make yourself happy make yourself fulfilled that's all that matters bro honestly we were all brought here on the same time and we're all gonna die right around the same time so there's no reason to take take any of this serious bro i don't even take myself serious that much anymore I don't even take my job serious, honestly. And, and life is not meant to be taken serious, bro. Like you look at everything in nature. Is nature serious? Are the trees serious? Are the clouds serious? Are the, is the grass serious? Are the animals serious? No, everything is just flowing in its own state. Everything is just in peace and harmony with the universe. And we got to be in harmony with the universe, too, so that we can retrieve the downloads that are going to help us navigate life. And that's all I got to say. Um, yeah, I already said my outro. I love you guys. I'm, gonna I'm about to clock into work. Here we go. Peace.